Right, Matt, so Sunday's your big day. And it's looking like the weather might cooperate for your big debut. Well, that's what I said. I said, you throw me in there, the Grand Marshal mix with all the big names. Uh, you know what? I think the weather's <laughs> going to cooperate. Yes. Yeah. The last couple of times I've done something like that, it snowed. So oh. ah. luck it's, is, your, it's your time, buddy. <laughs> luck is on our side. Hey, it's going to be everyone's time this weekend, guys. It's looking gorgeous. And we're getting a nice little preview here tonight. Uh, after that sun came out today, boy, April sunshine went to work on it. We're at 66 right now, Medina, 67 in Akron. A little bit cooler up towards the lake shore. We've got a light breeze blowing off the lake. So if you're lakeside this evening, you will need a jacket. The rest of us, though, feeling pretty nice in the 60s. Gets warmer from there. We've got warm air building down towards the southern plains, 70s and 80s widespread. Even some 90s down towards Oklahoma today. For us, the warm air doesn't quite get here yet. We're going to settle back tomorrow. Actually, a little bit cooler than or tomorrow than today, as you'll see here in the forecast. But but tonight with temperatures sliding back into the 40s with clear skies, light winds and all that moisture we have in the ground. I would not be surprised if we had some fog developing after midnight. May have a foggy commute in spots tomorrow morning. It should burn off pretty quickly, though. Clouds are long gone. Notice how they exited out towards the east, leaving high pressure large and in charge across the Great Lakes. Down towards the south, though, that's where our eyes turn. That's where the heat's building. There's a system out towards the west. As that dives south, that's going to push all of this warm air off towards the north. It's got to get here via a warm front, though. And that warm front is the clash between the cold and the warmer air. And that's going to cause some showers and thunderstorms to develop. We're already seeing that. This is actually our rain and cloud chance tomorrow. As these get going off towards the north, we'll likely see some leftovers pushing in here later tomorrow. And that's what may hold us back early Saturday. I still think we may have some rain around early Saturday. So this is kind of the evolution of these. See how most of the storms stay west with that warm front. But you can see how they just kind of float in northeast Ohio with some rain during the afternoon and evening tomorrow and that could linger into Saturday. A closer look with your National Design Mart Hour by our forecast. Clear skies to start tomorrow. High clouds will start to stream in from the west, though. Here's your rainfall chance. It's going to be notably cooler near the lake tomorrow, so we'll likely stay 40s and 50s lakeside with a north wind. Meanwhile, you get further south down towards Akron, the Worcester area. It'll be much warmer. You notice the rain kind of sticking around throughout the evening as that warm front just doesn't get through here. It often doesn't this time of year. It will Saturday morning, perhaps early rain. Then it's out of here. The sun will peak out and it's going to be a much different air mass, likely up near 80 degrees. Forecasting 80 Saturday, Sunday 82. Just beautiful. The last time we've had back to back 80 degree days, 188 days ago. Last time that fell on a weekend, 221 days ago. It's been a little while. <laughs> Union Home Mortgage seven day forecast. Monday, not bad either. We will bring rain and rumbles in, but then we cool down again next week. 50s and 40s back in the forecast. Shouldn't last too long, but definitely back to reality. We'll be back after this.